Over the past few months, the DJI NEO 2 has become one of the most talked about upcoming drones in the community. Fresh leaks and insider details have started painting a clear picture of what this small but incredibly capable device might bring to the skies. And now that the hype around the DJI Mini 5 Pro has settled, all eyes are shifting toward DJI's next big release, a compact drone that could redefine what a pocket-sized flying camera can do. The first DJI NEO, released back in September 2024, surprised everyone. It was small, portable, and smart. The kind of drone that appealed not just to beginners, but also to advanced users who wanted something lightweight, quick to deploy, and fun to fly. It was designed as a versatile selfie drone, great for social media creators and casual pilots alike. But as successful as it was, users had a few complaints. Short battery life, loud propellers, and limited stability in windy or low light conditions. The DJI NEO 2 is expected to fix all of that, and add even more. Recent leaks reveal a lot about the upgrades coming with this next generation model. One of the most intriguing discoveries came from a product label leak mentioning that the NEO 2 features a Class 1 laser system. According to international safety standards, this means it emits radiation that's safe for human eyes. But more importantly, it hints that DJI has integrated a 3D infrared distance sensor similar to what we saw on the DJI Flip. This could dramatically improve obstacle detection and depth sensing, especially in complex environments. Design-wise, the new NEO2 is shaping up to be slightly larger than its predecessor, especially at the front, likely to accommodate the new sensor. Some leaked prototype footage even showed the drone covered with taped areas, possibly to hide new components mounted on the top shell. Observers also noticed redesigned propeller guards, which may serve to reduce vibration and noise during flight, something that many users requested after using the original NEO. When it comes to power, the DJI NEO 2 is said to include a 1606 mAh battery, compared to 1435 mAh on the previous version. That's about a 9% increase in capacity. It may not sound like much, but DJI has made remarkable progress in power efficiency lately, especially visible with the Mini 5 series. With better energy management, the NEO2 could achieve between 20 and 23 minutes of flight time, compared to just 18 minutes on the original. For a drone of this size, that's a meaningful improvement. The camera system will also be significantly upgraded. The first generation model used a 1-2 inch 12 metal piece sensor that captured 4K video at 30 FPS, which was decent but limited. The NEO2 is rumored to pack a 1 1.3 inch 48 metal piece sensor the same size found in DJI's Flip series, capable of recording 4K at 60 FPS with a 150 Mbps bitrate. This should result in sharper details, better dynamic range, and much improved low light performance. Even though the gimbal will likely remain a single axis system to keep the weight low, the software-based electronic image stabilization will be stronger and more refined, providing smooth, professional looking footage. One of the major issues with the first NEO was its instability during night flights or in dim indoor environments. That happened because the positioning sensors struggled to lock onto surfaces when lighting was poor. DJI might fix this with improved optical and infrared sensors, or even by adding a small LED light under the drone to help the sensors see the ground more clearly in darkness. Noise reduction is another focus area. The original NEO produced a sharp, high-pitched whine that many users found annoying. This time, DJI is likely redesigning the propellers with a new aerodynamic structure and extra blades to reduce that sound signature, similar to how they refined the Mavic and Phantom lines. For connectivity and range, the OcuSync 4 transmission system will likely return. It already offers great reliability and low latency, but with better energy efficiency, the NEO2 could maintain a stronger signal over longer distances. The new model might also gain a little weight, expected to be around 180 grams compared to 135 grams before. While that might sound like a downside, it's actually beneficial for flight stability. The added mass will make the drone more resistant to wind gusts, allowing it to handle conditions up to level five winds without losing balance or control. Of course, DJI knows not to mess with the formula that made the first model so popular. The NEO2 will still feature multiple control options, including pre-programmed gesture commands, a virtual joystick through the mobile app, voice controls, and full compatibility with accessories like the DJI FPV Controller 3, RC Motion 3, and Goggles 3, 
goggles N3 for immersive FPV flying. As for pricing, current leaks suggest that the standalone version, drone only, will retail for around $230 USD, while the Fly More combo, which includes a controller, carrying case, and extra batteries, should cost about $330 USD. The official launch window is rumored to be mid-November 2025, though DJI has yet to confirm a date. If all these rumors turn out to be true, the DJI Neo 2 could easily become one of the most exciting mini drones ever made. With a new sensor system, better camera, longer battery life, and refined stability, it's clear that DJI is doubling down on making drones that are smaller, smarter, and more powerful than ever. The NEO 2 won't just be a toy. It could become the go-to drone for vloggers, travelers, and aerial content creators looking for a lightweight but high-performing camera in the sky. So what do you think? Will the DJI NEO 2 live up to the hype and become DJI's next compact hit? Let me know down below. And don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss the next update when DJI finally unveils this incredible new drone.